Hey guys, John here, and welcome back to the series, How to Use Harmless. This is video four, and today we're talking about the pluck knob. So let's load up a default patch here and do the usual. Okay, and bring down the volume here. So what is this pluck knob? So we, we play a note and we drag this down. Okay, cool, so we have a plucked sound. But what really makes this very, very cool is these three little options here, masked, alt, and release. So let's look at mast first here. So let's have our mix knob at noon here. So I'll click that to the top here. Now, when, when we hit masked, basically these sliders here now control the decay individually of those harmonics. So let's bring this up just a little bit here and let's turn all of these down. Look at the first one. Now we can see a little effect here. So if we turn this down as well, we have our standard plug and as we bring the first one up, this first decay is going to be a little bit shorter and the second one it's going to see here a little bit faster or a faster decay third and so on and so forth the little longer uh pluck we can see a little bit a little bit more if we have all these up and then let's pick a few to kind of uh make them a little bit longer so all these longer harmonics here reflect these four that we pulled down right there. So I put these all back to bottom. So an easy way to remember this is that at the top, it's going to be a quicker decay and at the bottom, it's going to be a longer decay. So if we have these first two up here, these first two are going to decay very, very, very fast. All right. So next up we have alt and basically alt what that's going to do is that's going to make this equalizer kind of do the same thing a little bit this is going to control the decay of these harmonics so we can kind of pull these first ones down and bring these other ones up and we can see how that changes the sound as well See, now these are so far down that you can't even really hear them or see them. And then if we use this phase knob all the way to the left, we already get a pretty cool metallic-y type of string sound almost. And let's go back to a default here, and let's look at the release version of that. So basically, you're gonna to have to have a long release to really see this effect here. And what's gonna happen here is that this pluck is only going to really engage once the note is released. So if we have a, a pluck curve, let's bring this down. We have our standard pluck. We hold it down and our pluck is engaged. But if we hit release, we can hold the note and then at the end, once we release the note, then that pluck effect is gonna take place as we can see it kind of fading away there. Or if we bring it up. And if we had it off and the plug completely off, that's just a regular release and then turn on release, bring this plug down. You can see the differences of the decay on the harmonics as well. So that's basically plug in a nutshell, a very cool feature. I kind of really liked mast a lot because you can kind of really get into the nit gritty of the harmonics individually. Very cool feature. And in the next video, we're going to be talking about this amp section with the, obviously the volume pitch. This detune is slightly different, the grit and all these other buttons over here. So we'll see you in the next video.